The popular poinsettia inspired several different types of Tiffany lampshades, three of which you see here. Original to Mexico, this plant was introduced to the United States in the early 19th century. It was given its common English name, poinsettia, to honor Joel Roberts Poinsett, who introduced the species to America. Poinsettias were long associated with the Christmas season, but a special grafting technique was developed in America and caused their popularity to flourish because they became widely available in the American market. It is no wonder then that the Tiffany Studios decided to capitalize on the popularity of this ornamental plant by introducing various poinsettia designs to their line of leaded glass lampshades. The deep crimsons, bold reds, and subtle pinks of the poinsettia lent themselves to interpretation in glass. The two table lamps, when compared with the hanging shade, offer an interesting contrast to the different ways that the poinsettia was interpreted at the Tiffany Studios. The dome-shaped shades of the table lamps are encircled by a frieze of poinsettias that have been interpreted in a conventionalized style, that is, a simplified, less naturalistic version of the poinsettia. The color variety of the poinsettia plant is celebrated in these lampshades by alternating the blossoms from red to pink to deep crimson. The streaks in the glass simulate the veining of the colorful leaves, and the glass has been selected in such a way where it shades from light to dark as though the sun is breaking over the blossoms. This concept is more fully developed in the poinsettia hanging shade. Whereas the table lamps were made of a repeating design, the design, for instance, repeats three times around the dome shades, the poinsettia hanging shade is a non-repeating pattern. This is unusual in Tiffany lamps and really only characteristic of these large cone-shaped shades. This means that each side of this hanging shade is different. The large expanse of this cone allowed Tiffany's designers to interpret the poinsettia in a variety of ways, showing different sides and angles and patterns of growth. And while the reds and pinks of poinsettias would wane and fade following the Christmas season, these glass gardens would remain ever red and ever true throughout the year.